Hey guys, Thunder E here, and uh, first off, I just want to say, hopefully everyone is staying safe, uh, healthy. I know we all, most of us are at home, and it's a tough time now, and I just want to send out uh, just some good wishes to everyone. Please stay safe if you are sick. Hopefully you get better soon, and hopefully this video is something fun that you would enjoy as we make it. So I finally got to check out the Mate XS. Now, if you remember, the Mate X came out last year. Daniel got his hands on the device. Uh, it's a solid device, and the Mate XS is the latest foldable from Huawei. Uh, it's, it costs about 2,500, uh, but this device is very different in terms of what you have for foldables. It doesn't close up, it opens up. It's a eight inch display that falls into a 6.6 .6 for a smartphone. It feels like a smartphone in that uh, aspect ratio. This place is actually quite lovely uh, in terms of resolution, brightness, the wallpapers look good. Yes, the links will be down there for you guys below. Uh, it's a sharp and beautiful looking display. I think a lot of people will like uh, just the way it looks. Um, now, the display doesn't necessarily bend and stay. You've got a button that actually opens it up for you, and then you can straighten it out and you can close it back if you want to use in tablet or phone mode. In terms of specs, you've got, of course, Kirin 990, 5G variant. You've got it was a Sanit 7 nanometer chipset, 8 gigs of RAM, 512 gigabytes of storage, no micro XD expansion, no headphone jack. Uh, that's to be expected with this kind of form factor. Um, but there's a lot there to, for us to check out, of course, games, which is what we like to do on this channel. Um, and we got to check out a few games. We also got to check out the audio, uh, did some temp. So let's start off with some gaming, take a look at some of the games we actually played, which you can download directly from uh, the App Store. Um, and uh, yeah, so let's jump in. So gaming wise, um, I mean, it handles well. I mean, it's supposed to, and it does. And that's the thing I like about it. Like with eight gigs of RAM, which in comparison to a lot of devices now, uh, seems quite small. RAM management is 
beautifully done. I think that's something Huawei always does quite well. So this also showcases with this device. Uh, playing Call of Duty Mobile, PUBG Mobile, Fortnite, Asphalt 9, Blade of God, all those games ran absolutely well. Also, uh, handle the aspect ratio well because they have an app scaling feature that can scale your applications. Um, uh, so which means while you saw me out while I'm gaming, I can start with in tablet mode and switch down into a phone mode. I can go from phone mode to tablet mode and that's nice. Now that aspect ratio is kind of funky at, at 195 uh, by nine, um, but playing games on that is really, really refreshing. I, I do like the scale and size. Some games may not fit as well as, as others in my mind, but I think they handled it well in terms of use. Uh, in terms of uh, heat dissipation, I was I literally only got 85 degrees in terms of temps. So I'm, I am impressed with that. Um, I would like to see more companies kind of follow around because gaming um, processors tend to get really hot. So cooling is good. And again, I spent at least a couple of hours gaming on this device. Now, audio wise, I was quite impressed with the audio. Granted, it's a dual speaker system, uh, although most of the audio really comes from the bottom speaker, uh, but take a quick listen. Yeah, 111 decibels. I mean, that's a loud uh, uh, speaker. And also quite clear, especially when you're listening to the games and also just listening to the music that I, I quickly played here. And I think a lot of people like that. 4,500 milliamp battery in there. And you've got a, it charges with a 55 watt charger. Although the charger that comes with it is a 65 watt charger, which should give you 85% uh, in 30 minutes. I like that. It's nice, it's simple, and it's effective. At least for me, gaming wise, with a different aspect ratio, a different display. I like bigger displays to game. I think it makes a lot more sense. And I think a lot of people will like that too. Uh, so let me know what your thoughts are on the Huawei Mate XS in our first gaming impressions, first look. If you have any questions or any comments, let me know. Otherwise, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, um, and Always enjoy your entertainment, guys, and definitely stay safe.